Unit 8, Lesson 4, Test. Number 1. Which of the following is the primary reason Venus is the hottest planet in the solar system? A. The atmosphere of Venus reflects sunlight back into space. B. The surface of Venus absorbs solar radiation from the sun. C. The rotation of Venus affects how the sun's rays penetrate its atmosphere. D. The atmosphere of Venus radiates heat back down to the surface of the planet. Number 2. Unlike Earth, which tilts on its axis, Mercury has no axial tilt. How does Mercury's lack of axial tilt affect its seasons? A. Mercury has no seasons. B. Mercury has two seasons. C. Mercury has longer seasons. D. Mercury has shorter seasons. Number three, a planet's surface gravity influences the thickness of the atmosphere that surrounds the planet. The table below shows the surface gravities of the terrestrial planets as a percentage of the surface gravity of Earth. Earth's surface gravity is 100% of Earth's surface gravity. Mars is 37% of Earth's gravity. Mercury is 38% of Earth's gravity. Venus is 89% of Earth's gravity. Based on their surface gravities, which terrestrial planets would have the thickest atmospheres? A, Mars and Venus. B, Earth and Venus. C, Mars and Mercury. D, Mer Earth and Mercury. Number four, Venus and Earth have similar surface gravities. Mercury and Mars are almost the same surface gravity, even though Mercury is much smaller. Density is related to the force of gravity. The figure below contains information about the densities of the four planets. Mercury, 5.42 grams per cubic centimeter. Venus, 5.25 grams per cubic centimeter. Earth, 5.52 grams per cubic centimeter. Mars, 3.93 grams per cubic centimeter. Which of these statements explains the similar surface gravities on Mars and Mercury? Hint, step one, compare the densities of Mercury and Mars. Step two, relate the densities to surface gravity of the planets. A, Mars is denser than Mercury. B, Mars is smaller than Mercury. C, Mars is less dense than Mercury. D, Mars is less rocky than Mercury. Number five, Mars year is 686 days long. That is about twice as long as a year on Earth. Why is a year on Mars so long? A. Mars orbit is elliptical. B. Mars atmosphere is very thin. C. Mars rotation speed is very slow. D. Mars orbit is farther from the Sun than Earth. Number six. What is the order of the distances of the terrestrial planets from the Sun from farthest to closest? A. Mars, Venus, Earth, Mercury. B. Mars, Earth, Venus, Mercury. C. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars. D. Venus, Earth, Mars, Mercury. Number seven. Which of the following statements best describes the characteristics of the terrestrial planets? A. Small, dense, rocky surfaces. B. Large planetary rings, many moons. C. Rocky cores close to the sun, surface craters. D. Made up of hydrogen and helium, small, close to the sun. Number 8. The table shows surface temperature and atmospheric pressures for the terrestrial planets. Earth, minus 89 to 58. Mars, minus 140 to 20. Mercury, minus 184 to 427. Venus, 465 average temperature. Atmospheric pressure compared to Earth, 1 for Earth, 0 0.007 for Mars, 2 times 10 to the minus 12th for Mercury, and 91 for Venus. How does atmospheric pressure appear to relate to the surface temperatures on these planets? Hint, step one, decide which planets have higher pressures and which have lower pressures. 
Step two, determine what the, plant, the temperature variation is like for the planets with lower pressures and the planets with higher pressures. A, no temperature variation for planets with lower pressures. B, least temperature variation for planets with lower pressures. C, least temperature variation for planets with higher pressures. D, most temperature variation for planets with higher pressure. Number nine, Earth is one atomic unit away from the sun. This distance stays nearly the same as Earth revolves around the sun. This is because the Earth's orbit is almost circular. Mercury's orbit is elliptical. What does this mean in regard to Mercury's distance from the sun? A. Mercury follows a zigzag path around the sun. B. Mercury's distance from the sun is always the same. C. Mercury travels farther from the sun than Earth does. D. Mercury's distance from the sun varies in predictable ways. Number 10. Earth is made up of layers. The figure below shows the composition of the Earth's layers. Which of these statements best describes the density of the Earth's layers? A. Density is greatest in the crust. B. Density increases from crust to core. C. Density decreases from crust to core. D. Density increases and then decreases from crust to core. Number 11. Mercury's year is 88 days long. That is about a fourth as long as a year on Earth. Why is a year on Mercury so short? A. Mercury's orbit is elliptical. B. Mercury's atmosphere is very thin. C. Mercury's rotation speed is very slow. D. Mercury's orbit is closer to the Sun. Number 12. A planet's surface gravity influences the thickness of the atmosphere that surrounds the planet. The table below shows the surface gravities of the terrestrial planets as a percentage of the surface gravity of Earth. Earth, 100. Mars, 37. Mercury, 38. Venus, 89. Based on their surface gravities, which terrestrial planets would have atmospheres that are the least thick? A, Mars and Venus. B, Earth and Venus. C, Mars and Mercury. D, Earth and Mercury. Number 13. What type of surface do the terrestrial planets have? A, gaseous. B, ice-covered. B, liquid. D, solid. Number 14. The terrestrial planets include Mars, Venus, Earth, and which other planet? A, Mercury. B, Jupiter. C, Saturn. D, Uranus. Number 15. Which terrestrial planets have diameters that are nearly equal in size? A, Earth and Mars. B, Mars and Venus. C, Earth and Venus. D, Mars and Mercury. Number 16. Which of the following is the most accurate range of surface temperatures on the Earth? A, minus 100 degrees Celsius to 20 degrees Celsius. B, minus 85 degrees Celsius to 55 degrees Celsius. C, minus 50 degrees Celsius to 90 degrees Celsius. D, minus 25 degrees Celsius to 115 degrees Celsius. Which of the following temperatures is least likely to be recorded on the Earth's surface? Earth's surface. A, minus 75 degrees Celsius. B, zero degrees Celsius. C, 50 degrees Celsius. D, 100 degrees Celsius. Number 18. Earth, Mercury, and Venus are all classified as terrestrial planets. When compared to Earth, which of the following is true of Mercury and Venus? A. Mercury and Venus have higher surface gravity than Earth. B. Mercury and Venus have longer period of revolution than Earth. C. Mercury and Venus have slower periods of rotation or longer days than Earth. D. Mercury and Venus are farther away from the Sun than Earth. Number 19. Which of the following lists accurately relates which terrestrial planets have moons and how many moons they have? A. Mercury and Venus have no moons. Earth has one moon and Mars has two moons. B. Mercury, Venus, and Earth, one moon each, and Mars has two moons. C. Mercury and Venus have no moons. Earth has two moons and Mars has two moons. D. Mercury and Venus have no moons, Earth has one moon, and Mars has three moons. 
Number 20. Below is a table showing the decimal percentage a person would weigh on each planet in our solar system. If you weighed 125 pounds on Earth, how much would you weigh on Mars? The decimal percentage Mercury is 0.38. Decimal percentage for Venus is 0.91. For Earth, it would be 1.0. For Mars, it would be 0.38. Jupiter's 2.34. Saturn's 1.06. Uranus is 0.92. And Neptune is 1.19. A, 125 pounds. B, 100 pounds. C, 47.5 pounds. D, 38 pounds.